Well, today we are in Fort Lauderdale, Florida, looking at perhaps one of my favorite 70-foot hatteras of all time. This is a 1990 model. It has the 1292 Detroits. Two generators. She is in very, very, very nice condition. The paint is good. The stainless is good. The windows are good. The remodeling that's taken place on this boat, I personally like a lot. I like the layout of this boat. I like the decorations of this boat. I am a big, big fan. This boat's in nice condition. Just got back from the Bahamas. I'm supposed to show her to you today, Joe, but we'll get this done another time. There's a nice cockpit back here, a little aft deck. She has a tender up top. We'll go up there later. Boat is just very nice. I don't know if you can see the shine from the video, but the paint's in good shape. Everything about this boat, I just like it. I like this boat a lot. We'll go on board and take a look at what they've done to make her rather special. She's a very, very pretty boat. To begin with, they have hardwood floors. Beautiful neutral colors. They put the staircase, the semicircular staircase, up to the flybridge. Good electronics. No bow thruster. We have a cherry or walnut finish. It's very nice. You see the windows are nice. Headliner is newer. Very well appointed. I like this boat. The hardwood flooring goes back into the galley. We have a step up for the semicircular dinette. Nice soft leather material. They put a LG little flat screen TV up in here. Granite countertops, all stainless appliances. Wine cooler. Cherry wood finished. Six burner top stove. That's nice. Twin stainless sink. Dishwasher. Wine cooler. I have drawers on this step there. Back into the salon. Again with the dark wood finish. I did a nice little piece here for the master entry. Profile sofa. It looks more open. Again, new headliner. Walls, windows, headliner, everything's beautiful. 52 inch LG flat screen. Nice entertainment package over here. Well done. Carpet's in perfect condition. Go out into this half deck, show you a different view of this. Get an idea of how deep it is. Not a ton of space on the aft deck for the 70. Space back here. A good little cockpit. Storage beneath the cock box in the window to the master. Go back inside. Yeah, a little bit of cracking on this door on right the bottom. Not a big deal. Close this back. Keep the air conditioning on. Go down to the master. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Try to get it from a different angle here. See if you can get this. A 
This for me, this is my taste. I like this a lot. Go down below. Nice lighting throughout the boat. Nice flooring. A mastery of a king size bed. Very, again, very well appointed. Just nice. Flat screen looks like a 30 inch, 32 inch Vizio. Plenty of drawer space. A little set T on the port side. We have a mirrored door that well, goes into a walk-in closet, nice spacious walk-in closet. I don't know if you can see in here, should I turn the lights on? I left the doors open so we can go straight into the engine room. It has a walk-through engine room. Again, a feature I like a lot. Engine room is very, very clean. And then we go through into the VIP. It has a queen berth in the VIP. And sweet head. Did I show the head for the master? Let's go back. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> master stateroom head. Has a tub. I believe it's a jacuzzi tub. Very nice. Mirrored ceilings. Now we'll go forward to the VIP. And it still has a queen size bed. A little set T, little closet space here. Again, a single sink, shower stall, all marble tiled, floors are all marble. There's no smell on this boat, it's very clean. and dryer in here, a little laundry area. This is probably the linen closet, laundry closet. Going up four steps, more marble flooring, generators down in there. I'm not going to lift that up now, but we have the guest head or day head. Get all marble tiled. Very nice. That's well done. For the port side, we have the twins guest, the twin beds side by side, guest stateroom. And all the way forward, either crew or more guests, twin over and under bunks, and an end suite head. Go back up top. All right, let's see. And this is open, so I'll lift this up. It's hydraulic. Take a quick peek down into the generator room. See if I can get a light on without much fuss. generator, the F generator. The air 
practitioners. I can go back up top, up to the flybridge. I didn't take all the cushions out, they had just been put away, but I'll show you the space that we have up there. Ample space. See plenty of people. Great visibility. Typical Hatteras. Wrap around seating. Nice sized table. Good space for the storage of the tender. This one has a refrigerator. Dual captain seats. They just put the electronics away for up top. There we are. This is One World Yachts. I'm out. On board a beautiful 70 foot Hatteras, 1990, located in Fort Lauderdale, Florida.